Welcome to part three of installing a Blu-ray drive. Not sure why there's so many parts, but whatever. Anyway, I did install this. I went ahead and took the liberty because it was not fun getting my little hands in there. Although, I guess they're not super small. So basically what we need to do is we need to route this through here so we can get to this data. And I think actually I'm going to route it through here. So yeah. Now I got the SATA power plugged in. As you can see, I kind of shoved it up in there because I'm not going to see it anyway. And honestly, I don't really care. I'll build a new computer with better aesthetics. This thing is really friggin' dirty. Well, got a SATA cable. Pretty short, but it'll literally do what I need it to do. So we're going to install it. And the disk drive is now installed. And as you can see, I kind of made an adjustment to the cables only because that was really bugging me. But, uh, yeah, so the, this drive's installed, and that's about it. If you guys want to see a part four of me using it, let me know in the comments.